Why wouldn't you use an IUL policy instead, Pamela? I believe there's inherent risk within an IUL that I don't have to deal with with a whole life insurance contract. So the way I have interpreted an index universal life insurance policy, it's like a glorified investment account where I'm purchasing index options and I'm getting a tax-free rate of return on my money. That part sounds great, no doubt. That part sounds great. But I had the honor and privilege, Pamela, of being able to hear from some of the top leaders in the IUL space. And here is what they they educated me on. They said that a, a IUL requires more attention on a year by year basis, right? So what you have to understand about the IUL, Pamela, this is not, not a set and forget. Some people are looking for a set and forget location to safely store savings dollars. So there is inherent risk in this, in this IUL policy that we can't ignore, right? We can't ignore it. What are those inherent risks? Well, there are fees, there are costs that do not stay the same. So fees and costs change over time. We can't ignore that, Pamela. When I'm, when I'm taking savings dollars, if I was willing to invest with inherent risk of the other 200K, right? So of my, of my 200K minus 80,000, that's 120,000, 120,000, that money. Yeah, I'll, I'll put at risk for a rate of return, or I can put my 120 into my own business instead of the S and P 500 and the index, I can invest in the S and me 500 and create more value. So instead of fighting for rates of returns, I could probably get a much higher rate of return on my money. So that's something that I had to process for myself. But when it comes to money that I don't want to lose, we, and this is like the top leaders in the IUL space were at the end asset mastermind. And they were saying that the coming from their own words, there's some inherent risk, not a set and forget fees change over time. And, and you have to maintain this. It requires maintenance in this account. So you have to have a good relationship with the IUL agent to help you navigate the different indexes and things like that right so that's just a quick thing uh, uh pamela i won't spend too much time on it it's just when we're talking savings dollars right that's all we're talking about here savings dollars i don't want to have any of my savings dollars at risk i need that money to continue to grow i don't need i don't need it to grow a crazy amount right i just need it to consist consistently grow princess because market fluctuations can cause cash value to vary tremendously and prince is correctly right on this right absolutely correct how we doing friends don't sell friends in iul <laughs> funny andre whole life has the most guarantees it's a good argument can you can you say your email address so we can request a copy of that checklist yeah just scroll up in the in the comments uh it's in there i put it in there you can also look at the links go directly to my website contact me i'll send you that whole life insurance okay bad idea to introduce risk in an insurance policy which all verities of ul does yes defeats the purpose of the contract okay good wisdom boom glad you grew out of that there's no cash value okay wealth wisdom financial i didn't put them on the list all right that's an old list they're also they're under bank on yourself umbrella of content creators being aged is so important yes the best money you have is the money you control. Absolutely. A low death benefit cuts off the most important part of the policy. The end of the policy is infinitely more important than the beginning. Absolutely true. Your finding period should be as your funding period should be as long as possible. Ag agreed. Agreed. Absolutely. Ideally, your funding period should extend past your lifetime. I do find it interesting how people will ask about my commission, but the same client never questions the cost on 401k and things of that nature. The main thing is to be consistent. That is true. Help your client understand that there's commissions, there's fees, there are costs in all financial products and services. And I think having this understanding of what it does, what effect does it have will, I believe, help create an even better relationship between the agent 
and a client. And that's what I've experienced. I always, I'm like, here, here's what the commission would be if I did this way. Here's what the commission would be if I did that way. Here's what it'd be. Your base premium should eventually increase in the future. Less than 1% of the policies I've seen does this typically of those that devalue the death benefit. Your base premium should eventually increase in the future. Your base premium with an IUL, Andre, because with a, with a whole life, your base premium stays the same, which whether it's a 40, 60 split, 10, 90 split, whatever it is, that base premium always stays the same. So how about that? Hello, Tony. When you get it, you will want to fund your whole life. It's right there. Name the contract. Absolutely. Thank and uh, thank you. Uh, the heart of a teacher. I love your transparency. It's honor. Blessing to business. Okay. Love it. Love it. Thank you so much for this content. Okay. 64 people in the house, 48 likes. For the difference of people that haven't liked the video yet, please go ahead and like the video. Get that number up for me. Appreciate that. If you're enjoying getting a ton of value from this content, let's recap. Recap. Got to know your numbers. What are we looking at? Whole life insurance contract, the infant banking concept. You need to have a principal amount of money that you want to save minimum per year. We go to the two documents. We went over policy designs. We went over the questions that you want to ask the agent, questions you want to ask yourself. And we talked about other products and services that you want to think about in addition to your whole life insurance contract like HSA, like annuities, like long-term care, disability, Roth IRA, real estate, estate planning, legacy, planning, wills, and trusts. These are all things that you're eventually gonna want to really consider.